welcome back to the Viking Weekend channel, everyone. I am your host and Mighty Chieftain Salty Viking, and welcome to the post game of Pokemon Violet. Ding dong dong ding. <whistles> Calling students to the director's office Master Halbert, Miss Nimona, Master Arvin, and Miss Penny. Director Clavel would like to see you in his office. Ding dong 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 ding ding dong. Yeah, we're a, we're a bunch of ding dongs, all right. But uh, and as I said, welcome to the post game of Pokemon Violet. In the last video, we have finished up the main game. Uh, we saved the world from uh, Do Doc Professor Turo's uh, disastrous time machine. And uh, we will now venture forth and see what the post game has to await us. So we should go to the director's office as we, as, uh, where do you want to go? We're going to go all the way to the director's office. Ah, looks like the hero's finally here. Would you join us, Master Halbert? We're in for an earful, aren't we? Guess we'll find out soon enough. No need for concern, you two. I'm not angry in the slightest. I merely called you all here to discuss your fine achievements in this year's treasure hunt. You shut down the professor's time machine and thus prevented the Pokemon from the future from running rampant across Paldea. Your actions were truly outstanding in every regard, and I couldn't be prouder of all of you. Though your decision to enter a strictly off-limits area was admittedly, admittedly regrettable. Hey, you gotta stare. However, since this was necessary to protect Paldea and its precious ecosystems, I'm willing to overlook that particular point. Whew, so we're not getting raked over the coals after all? Oh, before I forget, Master Halbert, there's something I would like you to have. Each of your friends has received one already, so this one is for you. Yep, we got our Master Ball. The very best Pokemon with the ultimate level of performance. With it, you will catch any wild Pokemon without fail. And, of course, in this game, you get only one. Unless you're l lucky enough to find another one, which is usually like a, a Pokemon lottery or something. But I don't think that they really have that in this, this uh, iteration. I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Oh, and about the Hall of Fame badge I gave you a short while ago. That gift is one we bestow only upon students who achieve truly remarkable feats. I expect you to honor what the badge represents by striving always to serve as a model for your fellow students. You can count on me. Splendid. Such enthusiasm will surely take you far in life. And Master Arvin... I was so sorry to hear about the professor. You have my deepest condolences. Uh, well... Yeah, it was pretty tough when I found out my dad had died. But weirdly enough, my head actually feels clear now. For the first time in ages. In the Great Crater, I got to learn a bit about my dad's research and what he was trying to achieve down there. I guess if you're building something as mind-blowing as a time machine, that takes priority over showering your son with attention, huh? All I know is I'm done feeling like I'm lo so, like some lost little kid. Done. Time to say goodbye and move on. I'm going to enjoy every last day till graduation with my buds here. And Mava Stiff, of course. Well said, Master Arvin. You truly are your father's son. Of course, I must remind you that you nowhere near enough credits to graduate. You'll need to study frantically to catch up, but I have expectation of your, every expectation of your success. What? Aww. And let us not forget the other good news. Our Academy has a new champion. Though we sadly cannot make your valiant deeds in the Great Crater known to public, your new champion rank, at least should be celebrated throughout the whole school. 
Ooh, I know how we should celebrate. We should hold a Pokemon battle contest. Seriously? Could we not? Classic Nimona. A Pokemon ba battle contest, you say? Well, your own vested interests in such a venture are more than apparent, Miss Nimona. I think it's a fine idea. But please understand that a large-scale event will be quite beyond us. We have many other school activities to keep an eye on, after all. Pardon my intrusion, but I couldn't help but overhear. Ah, uh, it's you. The Pokemon League will, of course, happily lend a hand in organizing this contest. La Primera! Well, well, a most kind offer, Chairman, Chairwoman Gita. I do everything in my power to nurture young and up-and-coming talent. Though so that's not to say only the youth have promise when it comes to Pokemon battles. A former gym leader, the developer of the Pokedex app, this academy clearly counts many skilled trainers of Pokemon among its staff. As such, my suggestion is as follows. Students and staff should compete for the title of strongest trainer at the academy. Whoa! We get to battle the teachers? You'd compete too, right, Primera? Is that even allowed? The chairwoman's not part of the academy, right? Actually, I think she's the chairwoman of the school board as well as the, the Pokemon League. Wait, for real? I mean, I knew she was on another level, but wow. Yeah, so you remember when uh, Miss Time said she was going to report Director Clavel to uh, the chairwoman of the school board? That would be her. <laughs> Thank you for the invitation, Champion Nimona. I would gladly take you up on your offer to compete alongside you all, but I'm afraid my schedule is already packed tight with work that I simply must attend to. Aw, oh, can't you free up some time somehow? Well, I suppose I might be able to participate if Champion Halbert would agree to lend me a hand with my work. Okay, where should I start? Excellent answer. Much obliged, Champion Halbert. To get straight to it, I would like you to go out and inspect Paldea's various gyms in my stead. Are they fulfilling their duties as beacons of strength and inspiration for all those aiming to achieve champion rank? Or has their brilliance started to fade? To find this out, I ask that you bring your full might as champion to bear against each of the gym leaders and test their prowess in battle. They are all trainers of exceptional talent and be handpicked by me personally. I do not expect you'll find any cracks in their armor, but, well, consider the formality. This will also provide the perfect stage for your per first appearance as a new champion. Since all the gym leaders will still be expecting me to carry out the inspection, I imagine they'll have mustered their full strength. I dare say they might be more of a challenge than when you faced them before. You get to have all-out battles with the gym leaders? Man, I'm jealous. You're a champion too, why don't you do it? Now then, on to another crucial matter. I'd like to discuss with Penny here how to patch the weaknesses in our league point system. Um, but there's a bunch of anime I've missed that I was just gonna binge. Thank you in advance for your willing and eager cooperation. Yeah, I don't think she's gonna take no for an answer on this one, considering that you did illegally hack into their system. Yeah, I mean, up to do it. I'll help. Let me help. Excellent. We'll leave you all to it, then. Come now, Penny. <laughs> this is awesome, Halbert. Show this inspection thing who's boss so that La Primera can join our tournament, okay? And enjoy taking another swing at the gym gauntlet while you're at it. I'll take care of filling out the forms and other administrative stuff so the ball gets rolling on the tournament in the meantime. I say, it's wonderful to see you all showing such initiative. You each have a critical role to play. Penny assisting the league, a new champion expecting gyms, Nimona arranging the event, 
give it your best, everyone. Guess my rule's so obvious, it goes without saying. Yeah, you need to go study, but... Alright. So, with that, we are going to be going back to... How to change Moridon's form. You select Moridon while the main menu is open. You can now have it change between its battle form and its ride form. Cool. Uh, okay, so we don't need to go see anybody else, so... We're going to go to the entrance hall. So in this video, we are going to battle all the gym leaders again. And as a bonus, because this is now the post-game, I am going to go after the Iron Leaves Paradox Pokemon for the, uh, the event. Uh... You know what, hang on, let's... Whoops, hang on, I didn't mean to do that. Wait a minute, I am not over there, damn it. <laughs> I'm over here. Or over here. And I just got completely turned around. Okay. Uh... Oh yeah, I was gonna go see Jock, see what he's up to. Uh, Biology Lab. He should be there. Aim to run for four. Okay, so he's not... Alright, um... So we're gonna head outside. And this one, I don't think it matters what order we do them in, so I'm just going to do like a full rotation around the map. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Alright, so we gotta go all the way around Paldea again. Actually, you know what? I think we're gonna go do, uh, um... The, um... The Terra Battle first, before we do that. Um, uh, okay, so we're gonna fly over to Poco Pap Lighthouse. Because we should be able to do level 5, um, Pokemon battles now. Alright, so it was over here. Oh, there's a Pokeball right below us. We'll get that. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I completely almost biffed it. Potion. Alright, we're gonna head on over... Where is it? I think it's... Is it that one down below? Um... Oh yeah, it's that one. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to pause the recording uh, long enough to actually... And then when I come back on, we'll be in to get the battle. So, I will be right back. Ah! 
Alright, new electric terrain. Four drive. Ow! Damn, okay. Oh shit! Oh man. This is not going well. See if we can try to get him down. Oh crap. As long as that Mega Horn is gonna be a pain in the ass to beat him. I'm the only one out. What the hell? Okay, yeah, so now we're... Oh, yeah, I'm done. That's it. Oof, that was harsh. Yeah, we lost that one, but uh, I, I, I guess I'm just going to have to do this one on, uh, on my own later. But, uh, ooh, that, I'm going to have to level up uh, before I can do that again. But, in, you know, no biggie. We're going to do the gym battles in this one. Alright, so I will be back later to do this one. So let's start, we're going to go counterclockwise here. We're going to start in Artisan. Not... Let's go fly over here. Oh boy, not a great way to start this video off. Alright, so we are an artisan. I'm going to pause the video and uh, get my team ready to battle them. And I'll be right back. Alright, so uh, we are outside the artisan gym. So we're going to start this battle here. He will be, Brassius will be the first one we go after. And like I said, we'll go counterclockwise around the map. So I think Katie will be the last one we go to. There's Brassius. Avant God. You are Halbert, no. You are the artist Halbert God. It's the champion, actually. That is of no consequence. Each time I recall our artistic battle, I found myself wishing to face you once again. I am so very glad that you are here. Praise Mother Nature. I had planned to meet with the top champion today, but I have just now canceled that plan. Shall we instead talk of art together? Sure. What? You came in the top champion stead? Well, I cannot be bothered by that. I don't care what the reason is. If we can make a masterpiece together once more, then fine. Well then, Halbert, are you ready to open wide a door to the world of art? Well, I don't know about that, but I'll battle you. Avant-garde. Very well, then. Let us head to my studio. What, you're not going to jump off the top of the windmill again? Behold, Halbert, the sight of Artisan's windmill. It catches the winds that blow across Caldea and slowly yet powerfully spins ever on. My leaping down from that windmill to appear before those who would challenge my gym lends an added depth to our battles. 
I, oh, I see. I knew you would understand my reasoning, Halbert. <laughs> Though I believe I can spare my legs today, as we are sure to create my greatest masterpiece yet, even if I do not alight from above. But I digress. We are both artists, are we not? We have no further use for words now. I assume you're ready. Let our collaborative work of art begin. You are challenged by Gym Leader Brassius. Here we go. Lilligant. Let us ponder the art we create together, Halbert. And we're going to go with a fire blast. Oh, great light screen. All right, I'll finish you off with Bitter Blade. All right, Serena, and that cheat Serena is just a grass type. So yeah, since light screen's up, I want to use a flying move. We'll bring out Noivern for this one. Okay, so we'll do hit him with an air slash. Oh, wow, I avoided that one. That would have been bad. That's two down, so I think he's got three more. Breloom. Yeah, we'll bring out Dragonite for this one. Go Dragonite! Alright, we're gonna rock him like a hurricane! Wow! That poor Braylon got annihilated. Okay, now we're good. Yeah, we'll switch. Since it is a normal type as well, we'll bring out, uh, Lucario. Okay, so... Hit him with a little Hadouken! Bam! Grass grew to cover the battlefield. Oh, that'll help, uh... Well, he's got one left. And this should be terrestrialization time. Yeah, we're gonna switch. Oh, yeah, we're gonna bring out a bomb of snow. We're so gonna bring out a bomb of snow. This works concept is the deep rooting nature of plants. A briar thorns out oh, crap, I completely missed it. Sorry guys. Start in the snow. Terrestrialization time. And we'll hit him with a blizzard. I do hope this work lives up to my expectations. I shall call it Truly Wudo, Part 2. Yeah, 
Here we go. Oh, damn. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, yeah, because I'm grass, so, well, so is he, but... Uh, we'll use Ice Punch now. And you're down. You defeated Gym Leader Brassius. Ah, uh, thank God. Oh, and all of a sudden it rained in the middle of the battle. Seeing you in the midst of battle, you are like a unique gradient, subtly changing hues. Righteous and yet gentle, such contrast. I lack the words to express it. My hat goes off to you. My battles with you are truly a gift. Each time I am made to remember how I felt so long ago when I first ventured into this world of art. Ah, I almost forgot. You were here for the gym inspection in the top champion's stead, correct? Well, that is of no consequence. Report on my gym here as you see fit. Ah, my inspiration is overflowing as if drawn from a bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece at once. Fa you must excuse me. Farewell. Alright, that is one down, seven to go. Alright, so, um, if you will excuse me, I'm going to pause the recording here, get my team ready to go, and we will go to uh, Lavincia, which will be the next town up, and t deal with Iono. So give me one moment. All right, we're back, and we're going to do the second gym leader now. That would be Iono of Lavincia, and she is right over here. The shadow of Glaciado Mountain. Alright. There's the gym. Let's go in. Oh, pardon me. And there's Ayano. Primera, your eyeballs are mine. Caught in my electro web. Who saw what's it? Who saw what's it? Ayono! Hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour. Wait, you aren't Gita. It's me. She sent me instead. Say what? You just became a champion and you're already out helping La Primera? Weren't you just doing your gym test like yesterday? You're really kicking butt out there. Wait, so basically what you're telling me is that right now is the perfect time for us to collab? I can see it now. I'll be more popular than ever. Yeah. Okay, I'm picking up what you're putting down, friendo. Since you're here to do the inspection for Gita, I'm going to give you a show you'll never forget. And I don't know about you, but I think it's t about time we got down to it. What do you say? Sure. Yes, here we go. Off to Battle Land. Yep, and she got her phone out. It's time for a trip to the Iono Zone. Hello, hello, hola, ciao, and bonjour. Welcome to the Iono Zone. It's me, Iono. Today's guest is our brand spanking newest champion, Albert. You've gone viral among the gym leaders, friendo. You're all we're talking about recently. 
I remember your gym test well. It was bzz, shocking. This stream's gonna trend like crazy. I can't wait to see those viewer numbers go up, up, up. All right, here we go. Got that camera set up just how I like it. I don't know about you all, but I'm ready to get this battle started. We'll call this stream Gym Leader Iono Battles like you've never seen before. Oh, here we go. Her and that jet, that long coat of hers. Okay, so... Yeah, we're not really going to be able to hit him with a ground. Time to put on my serious face. Eyes wide open like a Magnemite. So you don't miss a thing. Alright. We can't hit him with a... Uh... Maybe we can drop him with a heavy slam. Oof. Yeah, there's two problem Pokemon she has. Kilowattrol being... And Kilowattrol because it's a flyer and then her uh, Terastalized one. We'll get to that one in a moment. Yeah, right. Bam! I know it's about to send out Bellable. We'll switch, we'll bring in Garchomp. Go Garchomp! Alright. Who runs this arm? Dig, okay. No, you're not gonna hit me with water pulse. Nice try, though. Oh, damn, I thought I was gonna knock it out. Uh oh. Well, uh, good thing that didn't do anything. We'll just hit you one more time. There we go. Send out Luxray. We will... Switch Pokemon will bring back Iron Treads. I will right, we'll hit you with a little earthquake action here. have to send out Electro. We switch your Pokemon. Uh, we're gonna keep uh, right here. Oh, damn. Rumble, rumble, rumble. And you take a tumble. Alright, time for it's... I'm going to bring a Dragonite because I don't have a Pokemon that'll be able to touch her. Necessarily. Hey, Halbert, quit hogging the limelight and let me shine a bit, yo! Alright, 
Alright, we're gonna Giraffe Live. We're gonna hit him with a Dragon Rush. Come forth, shiny little light bulb. Be the invention that leads me to victory. Duh. Oh, she's gonna be faster than me. Great. My turn. It's Terra time. Oh, great. Bam. You are done. You need to be a gym leader on your own now. Our brand spanking newest champions, hot stuff. Aw, oh, man, I'm not super happy about losing, you know, but... Look at those viewer numbers. The Iono Zone's on a roll today. I'm on cloud nine. No, cloud ten. Having someone as popular as you on my stream was a great idea. I'm trending like the Internet's mad at me. We should collab like this regularly. Don't go appearing on any other channels, though. All right, I don't know about you, but I'm done. Tell La Primera what a sensation I was, okay? Your eyeballs are mine, caught in my electroweb. Who saw what's it? I don't know, signing off. Yeah, I've gotten to the point where I'm used to this now. <laughs> So that was number two. So we're going to go to number three. And the next one on the list should be Grusha. Since we're going counterclockwise. Alright, so we've done that one. Yep, Grusha would be next. So I'm going to fly here, and then we're going to... I'm going to do a quick pause, change up my party, and we will go from there. So I will be right back. All right, guys, so we got our team ready for battle number three. So let's roll on out, shall we? and see the man himself and who do I got to start yeah probably not a good idea oh wait a minute hold on guys sorry about that guys I did not do my due diligence to make sure that my team was ready all right actually I did and I just wasn't paying attention so we're going to put him up in front. So here we go. Alright, there's the man himself. Let's go chat with him. Huh? I recognize you. You're here to hit the slopes? I don't recall the snow being too good today. I'm here for a battle. Aw, uh, for real? I've got something important to be dealing with in a bit, you know? Oh, I see. You're here to cover for Gita. So your dream came true. You're champion rank now. You must be so happy. Oh, my bad. That sounded a lot more sarcastic than I had intended. Don't get me wrong. I really think it's amazing. Just, it's complicated for me. That's all. 
Anyway, you came to test my skills, right? Let's just get this over with. Alright, let's go. Let's head outside. You best hope it's not snowing. Yeah, Grusha just seems like he's bitter because he doesn't have a snowboarding career. And I get it. I mean, yeah, un unfortunate accidents happen, but... Well, tough luck for you. The snowy mountains are on my side today. These league-mandated inspections happen a few times a year. If we don't show we're up for the job, we'll lose our positions as gym leaders. Gita always says it's just a formality, but... I've already had to give up on being a pro snowboarder. If she takes away the talents I still have to show, then what'll be left? Sorry, didn't mean to bring the temperature down. It's simple enough, really. All I need to do is make sure the power of my Pokemon chills you to the bone. Here we go. We go. <clears throat> and we'll start with Sarah Ledge. This will be double effective. Boss it. Newtons are alright, I guess. Good enough to defeat you anyway. Since Frostmoth is both bug and ice, this should be very simple. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. This didn't do anything. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, I guess I gotta freeze him out. Ice heal. There we go. Okay, I was about to say, if he froze me again, I'd be pissed. Oh, you jerk. <sighs> okay. Alright. Oh, no, never mind. There we go. Well, that was a little ridiculous, wasn't it? Uh, Bear Tick, we're gonna uh, switch out. We're gonna bring in. I'm gonna bring in Metacham for this one. Uh, we'll do an axe kick. And one axe kick on the top of your head. Jim Leader Group's about to send us the Titan. Yeah, we'll switch again. I'll uh, do King Gambit this time. There we go. Oh, damn, didn't do it. This should not hurt. There we go. Uh, Jim Leader Group's about to send out Weevil. Yeah, we're going to bring out Lucario now. Weevil. And this 
decision, decisions. I'll throw, hit you with a meteor mash. Yeah, right. Take that. And it should be the last one. Altaria, yep. The switch, we're gonna bring out... Uh, oh, Tinkaton's fairy, never mind. But Iron Treads is uh, steel. I won't let things heat up any further. Time to bring the deep freeze. And... Brassalize. Heavy slam. Here we go. Let it freeze, let it snow, let it pile on top of us. Yeah, this is gonna be bad for you. Yep. And that's a wrap. Your burning passion. I kind of like it, to be honest. Man, Gita must really have it out for me, sending someone there's no way I could beat. Still, no regrets on my part. I gave it everything I had. I hit you full force, and I lost anyway. It made me feel frustrated. It makes me want to become stronger as a gym leader, put more of myself into it. I thought, I'd my, I thought my passion had frozen over, but you've rekindled it for me. Thanks, Halbert. I won't lose next time. You'll see. Try not to catch a cold on your way down the mountain, eh? Alright, that is number three. We're gonna... I'm gonna do one more for this video and then we'll call it a night. Uh, you know, I've been recording all day. I'm kind of exhausted, so we'll... So like I said, I'll do one more and uh, we'll call it a video. We'll do the, final, the other four in the next video. And fortunately for us, the fourth one is not too far from here. We're just going to go up here to Montenevra and deal with, uh, with Rhyme. All right. All right, so before I do that, let me um, put my team together. So I'll be right back. All right, we're back. So I'm going to be taking an Iron Treads, King Gambit, Gardevoir, Sarah Ledge, Metacham, and Tinkaton into this battle. So here we go, guys. I'll run up the steps here. I think out of all the town's soundtrack, I think Monster Nebra has the best one. With Lavencia being a close second. Alright, let's go on in. There's Rhyme. Let's do it. Well, if it isn't my little challenger, Halbert. What brings you back here, baby? Finally ready for that rap battle? Yeah, rap battle sounds great. <laughs> so you're a champion rank comedian, too. So instead of her, I get you? 
She sent a rookie champion instead of coming out here herself? Doesn't she know who I am? Sorry, I got heated there. Don't worry though. You aren't the one who struck that nerve. Oh well, I just I was just thinking I'd like to see you again anyway. Guess this is just how fate has it. If we're doing this, let's do it. Ready to show me how strong all those adventures made you? Sure thing. Now that's the spirit. Come on, let's put on a killer show. Well, I mean, I got, I do got jokes. I was hoping to rap battle. Oh well. I got bars. Ish. It feels like just yesterday that you were here for your gym test. Now you're all championed up and out doing errands for La Primera herself. Tell you something. You got, you get to be my age? Time starts passing you by fast. But that sentimental stuff's not worth my while. Time to kick a rhyme and hit the flow. Let's go! My spirit's burning, yearning to get this battle churning. You best be ready to begin. Our little champion is coming into his own. Come on, baby, rattle me down to the bone. Here we go. Set out Bannett and Mimikyu. Treads and King Gambit. Come on, rookie, show me you deserve to be called a champion. All right, so we're gonna hit him with an iron, hit Mimikyu with an iron head, even though I know it's not gonna do anything on the first try. And then we're gonna kowtow cleave Bennett here. Yuck! <laughs> Mimikyu's disguise was busted. Like that's not gonna do anything to me. Take that! One down. Alright, Houndstone. Iron Head. Kowtow Cleave. And one more. So that's three of her Pokemon down, so that means she's left her two heavy hitters remaining. Oh, here we go. Okay, so... How do I want to do this? Yeah, we'll bring in Tinkaton. And since and we're gonna Actually, let me back up. No, we're gonna, yeah, so we're gonna bring out God of War. And we're gonna kowtow cleave you. This ghostly ch change will turn your head eyes to lows. The brightest lights cast the darkest shows. Yep, thank you for that. Ow. 
You're done. She must have caught that spirit tomb that was on the end, the other, the uh, the western side of the mountain. Oh crap, Will O' Wisp. All right. Probably should have brought out Tinkerton instead. Oh well. You know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna bring out Tinkerton because uh, I think King Gambit's done his damage. Here we go. I should have probably brought Tinkerton out the first time, but oh well. Moon Blast! You're done. You defeat a gym leader, Ryan. You're cool, my friend. You move my soul. That's four down. So we are halfway home. <laughs> Wasn't expecting you to rattle me that much. You caught me off guard just like Shadow Sneak. Sorry for calling you a rookie. Hoping we're good. I just wanted to prove that the strength of ghost types of Gita, but I guess I got carried away. You're the real deal, my friend. I can guarantee that. From here, <clears throat> from here on out, Rhyme's got your back. If you run into any Vex and trainers or Hex inspectors, you just give me a call. Now you go enjoy this big wide world to the fullest. You hear me? Later, baby. All right. So we have officially defeated four of the gym, gym leaders in their, these revisit battles. We have four left to do, and we will do that in the next video. So, uh, as always, you know, like, comment, subscribe, and smash the bell to be kept up to date when future videos drop. And, as always, uh, this is your Mighty Chieftain Salty Viking reminding you, as always, to live brave and free, fight tooth and nail, and y'all have a glorious Viking weekend. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.